Like many other high-profile sportsmen and women, Mohamed El Neni has taken to social media to stand up for Palestine. The midfielder has tweeted, supporting his heart and soul alongside images of Al-Aqsa Mosque and Palestinian flags. El Neni's statement prompted Tal Offer, a senior member of British Jewish organization the Board of Deputies, to write a letter of complaint to Arsenal's sponsors. In response, Lavazza Group contacted Arsenal to raise its concerns. The Italian coffee company says the content of El Neni's post is not in line with the brand's values. But Arsenal have retaliated, releasing a statement which in part defends the midfielder, saying players are entitled to express their views. Despite the criticism from Lavazza, more than 120,000 people have liked El Neni's post, and he's not the only Premier League player showing solidarity with Palestine. Egyptian teammate Mohamed Salah has called on world leaders to do everything in their power to stop the killing of innocent people. And Sadio Mane has tweeted, Free Palestine. Both men play for Liverpool, who are also sponsored by Lavazza, but the coffee brand hasn't released any statement condemning the club or the players. Fans too have had their say. Hundreds of Gunners supporters have sided with El Neni. One fan has gone as far as saying the London club should stick by the Egyptian star and end their partnership with Lavazza. El Neni isn't the first and he won't be the last to speak out in solidarity with Palestinians. As Israel intensifies its bombardment of Gaza, more and more sportsmen and women are using their platforms to stand up against injustice. Lance Santos, TRT World.